Hello students. In this lecture, we are going to discuss about comparison of common elevator, common base, and common generator amplifier. Because in different applications, you must have seen that sometimes we use common elevator amplifier. In some other application, we use common generator amplifier. In few applications, we use common base amplifier amplifier. In cascode amplifier, cascode cascode amplifier, if you have heard about, you you use the cascade combination of common emitter and common base. Why? Because of what? Because of what features? In which configuration? We do prefer that transistor amplifier in particular application. Uh, why not other amplifier for that that application? And therefore, we need to understand a comparison among these three configurations: common emitter, common base, and common character amplifier. Before uh, discussing the comparison, we must have something in our mind that common emitter amplifier is always most popularly used in all the applications, irrespective of uh, the current gain in common character is the highest and the voltage gain in common base is highest. We do prefer common emitter amplifier in most of our applications. You can see the comparison. I have written hybrid parameters. Standard value of hybrid parameters for all the three configurations. Why I am comparing on the basis of hybrid parameters? Because you know that all these hybrid parameters are indicative values. What indicative values? What is HI? We do define it as the input impedance. What is HR? Reverse voltage gain. So we we'll have idea about forward voltage gain on the basis of HR. What about HF? Forward current gain. What about HO? What about HO? It is output impedance. All these parameters are standard parameters, normally at I equal to 1.3 milli ampere, and you can have a gist of comparison, a summary of comparison for all the three configurations based on these uh, hybrid parameter value. You can see that HI. If I write HI and this is common emitter amplifier, it means what is this? This is HI E. What about this? This is HI B. What about this? This is H I C, and similarly you can understand H R E, H R B, H R C, H F E, H F B, and H F C. So you can see the input impedance. Input impedance is almost equal in common character and common emitter. Common character, what is input terminal base? Common emitter, what is input terminal base? So base current is the input current. So almost same input impedance will be offered, and therefore it's very common sense. 1.1 k, 1.1 k is the standard value of HRT. This is the indicative value which we can understand that between common emitter and common character, the input impedance is almost same. What about common base? Input impedance is minimum in common base. What about the output resistance? If you say one upon output impedance is output impedance 2.04 mega ohm, which is highest you can see between the three configurations 40 k and 40 k. Almost same output impedance is there in common emitter and common character. Common character, which current flows in the output? Emitter current. In common emitter, which current flows in the output? Character current. Character current and common emitter current are almost equal. We know that 98% of emitter current is generally character current, but we can assume the values are similar values, and therefore the output resistance for common emitter and common character is almost same. If you get HOE and HOC, that is 25 microampere per volt, and if you get reciprocal of it, it becomes 40 kilo ohm, 40 kilo ohm. What about forward current gain? This is a, another important parameter. Forward current gain is 50 for which common emitter HF is 50. What about HOE, HFC minus 51? What is this? One plus HFE. This is minus of one plus HFE. Minus 51. What about this one? Minus 0.98. Minus 0.98 means if you do remember, we have studied IC is equal to alpha IE. IC is equal to alpha IE. What is this? In common base, what is current gain? General, the general purpose current gain that is beta. And sometimes you must, you you will see that HFB is equal. Here it is alpha. Alpha is equal to IC upon IE. Alpha. And what is the range of Alpha value, uh, well, uh, range of values for alpha, it is 0.98 to 0.998, and you can see the standard value 0.98. Why it is negative? You understand that one of the current is incoming and one of the current is outgoing, and uh, uh, the, the the expression, the value of alpha is normally negative value in the uh, transistor, so it is minus 0.98. But our interest here is not 
uh, to discuss about negative value or positive value. What is more important for her, for us in this lecture is, you can see that the highest current gain is there in common current, lowest current gain is there in common base. What about the voltage and current gain? You can see that reverse voltage gain, which is voltage gain in common current, which is the least. And what about this one? This is the highest voltage gain it provides. This may be 2.9 or 2.5 like that, but it hardly makes any difference. But the if you compare common base and common character, the significant comparison tells you the input impedance is lowest, here it is highest, almost. It is highest, output impedance is highest. It is in comparison with common base and common character. If you see common base and common character, uh, they behave, I mean, opposite to each other. See that? Current gain is lowest here, here it is highest. So, common base and common character normally behave opposite to each other. And as far as the common emitter is concerned, common emitter you can see that. And why common emitter is most popularly used? This is very important. You can see that the voltage gain is also not very low. As far as the current gain, it is also of some medium value. Unlike common base and common character, one of the value is highest, but second value is lowest. It's not like that. And therefore, and therefore here voltage gain is lowest, here the current gain is lowest in common base. And here, uh, oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. This is common base, this will be 2.9 into 20 to the power minus 4 and this will be nearly equal to 1. This has been replaced, I mean interchange. This is uh, nearly 1 for common character and this is uh, 2.9 into 20 to the power minus 4 for common base. And this is, this presents you the comparison between common base, common emitter and common collector. Thank you.